This could be our last goodbye, our last goodbye, she never told me why. This could be our last goodbye, oh I won't meet again. We watched her breathing through the night, through the night with a candle burning bright. She couldn't get to sleep that night, she won't have that problem anymore. My bathroom looks like a crime scene now, blood on the floor and the walls in the loo. Let's hope they never find her body or I'll be a dead woman too. I believe Akuma has lost her memory. Epiphany, this has happened multiple times. Although technically Libra and Sin do it more than Exuma does. She may have it back as I say this. No, genre savvy would be knowing that she's only faking it for attention. But I felt it best to keep you in the loop, as it is said. Thanks, um, I have no idea how much longer I have, so if I disappear mysteriously, it's because I had to make a quick getaway. No, just an eternal victim of his controlling mumsy or whatever. Thank you for letting me know. I'll be happy to help you think of things to do in different scenarios so you don't feel so... I believe the correct term for this is pussy whipped in regards to your family. I am not pussy whipped! They just have a lot of leverage over me! Like what, for instance? You say tomato, I say pussy whipped. By the way, Orion wasn't as dead as we thought, apparently. And Berylite's playing with Lee's memory. This may be a cliche, but it's also technically the first time it's happened, I think. Well, with Berylite anyway. Uh, she's Sin's crazy crown-steering half-sister. Well, I'm here to give random stilted exposition and commentary. Okay then, uh, wasn't she dead? Or maybe I was mistaken. <laughs> That's what I thought last night too. You're always mistaken. She will be. How are you going to find her? She'll make a stupid mistake. And you really don't deserve a straight answer. Well, Team Cinnamon's acquaintanceship with Ash was good for something. Well, he's also good at thinking up revenge scenarios for people Sin doesn't like. Yes. Yes, it does. You just confused me. That statement in question does not relate to our discussion. I just spoke to one of Ash's friends who had a spell to get Akuma's wings back. Because Red Bull, <laughs> it gives you wings. But so does crack too. You would know! <laughs> yeah, someone up and ripped him off. It 
was a character she wrote. Does that count? Yeah, she ripped him off that. I was like, dude, why the fuck do you have angel wings? How dare you! These are bird wings! Ghost in the shell is not finished. Though painful, it worked. She stopped relapsing into her past as well. I hate her. LET'S TEST THAT THEORY! According to Cory, Akuma and I also have a strong bond. I'd take that with a grain of salt if I were you. They tapped into it while she was regressing and were able to help her stabilize. Well, it's worked in the past with non cory entities, though I normally stayed away from that sort of thing. That's why it would be so fun. They could take me to outer space. Wouldn't it be fun? It was said that I am quite powerful, though to me it has felt as though I've been running on empty, nearly powerless in this realm. Hmm, I think so. I'm glad for you to have enjoyment. But if hobbies cause morality issues, they're likely to also cause you or someone else harm. I could contest that, but since that would require referencing a poem I've grown to loathe, I would choose not to. Either way, it's probably safest not to have hobbies at all. I'm certain the same is true for you. Well, yes. That's why I just said it. I admit that I like most of the names that don't end in W. You're worth so much more than you realize, my love. Although he'll never actually realize his full potential since he prefers sitting around and whinging about how the world's done him wrong. But Piff, he's not smart enough for science! I'm saying that there is none. Schadenfreude. Well that, that works too. Please don't ever feel badly if circumstances do not permit you to do all that you can. Feel shame! Feel shame! Well, he could have meant all that you normally could have done, but honestly, he's so very useless and ineffectual that he can't do anything anyway, and is most likely using his circumstances as an excuse to remain useless and ineffectual. Can they at least be used for science? See a point. I will not love you any less for it. Ugh. You know, I'm going to start shipping you with Akuma. Oh god, so this show is doomed. I would like to do something to help, so as far as I can think of, and as far as I can go, I would like to offer you and Ogi my services as a bodyguard. You know, just because she's known as Siobhan Augustine in this round doesn't mean you have to refer to her as Ogi. My cousin Lyria can take care of herself, but she has a trophy bodyguard to intimidate and mislead people. Now, just so there's no shock, I have offered Cory the same deal. 
So basically, Sinan and Libris are getting a sloppy seconds. But that was only because we were talking at the moment, and it was convenient. Yes, you only do things that are convenient. Hardcore. Yeah, pretty much. That annoying fellow from Devil May Cry is a bit more badass than him, even if he's completely overcompensating. Hey, at least he's not completely useless and ineffectual. Wait, did I just defend Dante? Uh, yes, skyscrapers. Very nice, the Demi Fiend. You guys are my priority right now. <laughs> and as soon as I get out of California, I would like to be your bodyguard. You can think, yet you're stuck at the same level of intelligence as my ex okay i am already working out a stick workout regiment wow look he's such a dedicated bodyguard He's gonna put a stick up his ass for training. <laughs> because only a serious bodyguard would train with sodomy. SODOMY! IT'S WHAT'S FOR DINNER! Wait, hold on. A what? WOW, JEFF! YOU'RE SUCH A FUCKING KILLJOY! Wow. He's almost as good at reading as Onion. So that I can protect you and Augie! I don't know. I just don't know. Maybe we should see other people. Do you guys accept? I'm a warlord, sweet one, but it is an endearing offer. First things first, GTFO. I was thinking much the same thing, actually. Get your own suitcase or duffel bag or backpack or whatever. Yes, but not Tupperware. Tupperware is useless right now. Oh, so it should work perfectly since Bastion is also useless. On a stick! Yeah, he might be using Tupperware for his training. With his stick! Let's put him in the dishwasher and find out. Is this the point at which you delve into your archives and withdraw quotes from other conversations? Hey, speaking of genre savvy... <laughs> Put as much as you can in it as far as important stuff goes. Can a Tupperware container even carry important stuff if it's useless? It can carry a stick! Don't forget the drawing of Lee, get a bus ticket and leave. No, it can't. I was talking to Evren. Took you long enough to answer. I was thinking about it. This evil genius of mine doesn't work on your schedule. If you can go farther back into your email, I sent you the link for a cheap hotel in Arizona. 
I never said that. Tell her I say hi. You need to stop letting your family control you, sweetheart. I need to leave. That's the only thing I need to do right now. Nope. Instead, he's just going to whine about how hard his life is while doing nothing to change it. Talk with Lee and me, come up with plans of what to say in different scenarios, and get the power! Are you trying to make me hungry because it is working and I dislike it when you try to put thoughts into my head? Come to think of it, I'm hungry too. Oh my Hades, everybody run! Money is power, and I don't want to hear about corruption. Have you met Akuma's Uncle Dante? No, but Corey did rip the idea for him off of him. Uh, pronouns, whatever. Probably not. I. Doubt he even knows what those are. It only corrupts you if you let it, and this isn't greed, this is necessity. Because I don't think that I know all the answers. I'm just saying what I think. Obviously, don't steal or anything. Anything. And yet, I get the weird feeling that nobody specifies as much as they need to on the show. But call Alex, my old boss. Ask for my old job. I'll save everyone some bullshit suspense. He never followed through. I believe Akuma has lost her memory. And everybody died! Will this be our last goodbye? Or will he ever tell me why? Will this be our last goodbye? Or will we meet again? I snuck into his room that night With a candle burning bright Nightmares kept him up all night But now he sleeps forever He wanted her to meet us halfway From Delaware coming to the bay When she didn't come to meet us that day He locked himself sulking in his room Everyone knows you reap what you sow Perhaps I went a little overboard But if they never find his body Then no one ever has to know La 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 this could be our last goodbye, last goodbye, she never told me why. This could be our last goodbye, oh why won't we meet again? We watched her breathing through the night, through the night with a candle burning bright. She couldn't get to sleep that night, she won't have that problem anymore. She was meant to meet us halfway, meet us halfway, coming from the bay. She broke her promise to meet us that day, she never could follow through. My bathroom looks like a crime scene now, blood on the floor and the walls of the loo. Let's hope they never find her body or I'll be a dead woman too.